the Gaylord Texan Hotel and Resort in Grapevine, Texas, with a very rare opportunity to meet with Barry Habib, the CEO of MBS Highway and the three-time Crystal Ball Award winner for the forecasting most accurate real estate in the U.S. And then we're off to meet with Debbie Gill, friend of mine with Keller Williams, to tour a 1930s historical home in downtown Grapevine near amazing restaurants and don't forget those wineries. I'm Kristen Walter Merkins, your host for Financing the American Dream. I'm here with Barry Abib, the three-time Crystal Ball Award winner for being the most accurate real estate forecaster in the U.S. Barry, tell me about what's going on with this crazy market. Well, Are houses affordable? Yeah. <laughs> you know, we're hearing about affordability. The media is talking about prices coming down. But what I'm here to tell you is that the real estate market is very healthy. Now, look, we know the transactions are not up there, but values are holding incredibly well. In fact, they're going up by every metric, Kristen, right now. Real estate values are at an all-time high. People think about that 2007 to 2010 period. That's the only time in the last 80 years where values actually went down. But there were 4 million units for sale then. Now there's a million across the U.S. And there was 301 million people in our population. Today it's 335 million. You mentioned affordability, and that's a great point to mention. So what mitigates that a lot is people forget that incomes are rising. And the amount of people that are still qualified overwhelms the amount of inventory that's out there. In fact, Kristen, there is less than half of the available inventory, those that are not in contract that are on the market, than they were pre-pandemic. So the market should remain very strong. We're seeing about six to seven percent appreciation in 2023 and somewhere around five to six percent going forward. That creates a lot of wealth, as you know. Even though people are hesitant to get into the market now, we're also seeing forecasting where rates are going to drop and that affordability is going to push them over with a gained equity to buy now because there's always that opportunity to reduce that payment. Kristen, that is such a smart question because what people are worried about is a seven percent mortgage rate. That's your best friend right now because rates will drop. See, inflation's already started to come down. When the labor market finally shows signs of slowing, the Fed will ease up. You're going to see rates come down. Hard to forecast exactly when, but we should see some easing in rates. When that happens, it brings more people into the market, more competition, less inventory. What do prices do? Get in now while you can. They'll go up. Barry, thank you so much for your time. It's, it's been a pleasure. A pleasure to be and, with you. Yeah, an amazing forecast. Thank you. Now we've come to downtown Grapevine to the historical district. This is 322 East College, and we're here to meet my friend Debbie with Keller Williams to tour this amazing house. Let's go. Debbie, this tour of this house has been amazing. I can't get over how the smart home technology is integrated in such a quality 1930s historical home, which you can see through the upgrades. What else is there to offer? There's so much to offer in this home, but one of the main selling features would be the carriage house. So from the carriage house, we can jump on the train and be in the airport and be anywhere within minutes, so. We've had quite the day getting a, an amazing rare interview with Barry Habib and then to end up with a house tour of a 1930s home, historical, but yet all the smart features. And now to end with some friends and a glass of wine right around the corner in Grapevine. Until next time, I'm Kristen, your host for Financing the American Dream.